We are fine. We are good. It is Monday. I'm still trying to wake up. My apologies. I've been up for like three hours, but apparently it's not enough time. Have my coffee. And uh, we're going to do our state. We have one left after this. But first, let us get through Wisconsin. The great state of Wisconsin. Here right in the Midwest, as you can see. To the north, it's bordered by Michigan. Lake Michigan. Lake Superior. A little nugget of Minnesota here. To the uh, east, Michigan. Lake Michigan. South, Illinois. Uh, Lake Michigan. <laughs> uh, Iowa. It all really depends on your angle. In Minnesota and to the west, Minnesota and Iowa. And if you live here, Lake Michigan or probably Green Bay. Anyway, that's the state. Its capital is uh, Madison. It was the 30th state admitted to the Union on May 29th, 1848. As we sit here, keep looking at Crossing Meadows and West Point. This seems to be a uh, development of sorts. I'm just trying to get, oh, this is a cul-de-sac. I chose poorly. What about this way? Get me, get me out of here. Get me over there. Get me out of this fresh hell. I'm just trying to get to the exit. And it's, it's, it's fighting me. Although I do see a sign here. Let me 16th fairway, so it makes me feel we are near a golf course. Was there a sign for sale? Or am I making that up? <clears throat> no, here we go. Uh, Hanson Building doesn't help me. Just this Wisconsin. All right, half this first one is done, and I've got nowhere, although this may help. Here we go. Oakwood Realty. City water, we got a sewer, single family or twindo condo instruction. I hate the word twindo. I didn't know it existed. I don't like it. Get me out of here onto a road so I can maybe find where we are. This is meandering. This is probably another sign. Maybe it's a little better resolution and I can make out words. Uh, not really. I'm going to take one quick look. Owned by Marvin Hansen Construction. That doesn't, that, okay, that doesn't help me. Get me out of here. Where am I going? Oh, finally a road. All right, all right. So we've got somewhere to uh, start from. 80% of the way through the video. Um, if you were to ask the average American what they thought of Wisconsin, they would probably say cheese, Green Bay, football, uh, that's really it. If you were a fan of, uh, Wayne's World, the movie, you would probably know a pretty good line from Alice Cooper. I don't know why this, this line is stuck in my head, but he talks about Milwaukee which comes from Miliwake, which is Algonquin for the good land. I have debated actually trying to find that clip and putting it in right there, but I think that probably would have caused more of a headache than anything else. I have no idea where this is, and I've not seen Rock County and Enro. That does not help me in any way. We're outside some sort of city. I'm going to say... Um, let's just zoom in real quick. Does these? That's a W. How close was I? I was not in any way. We were nowhere near an actual, um, like, big city. I thought that would have been a big mansion type place. Anyway, some of the other facts about the state. Let's get through those. The area, I'll zoom out just so you can kind of get an uh, idea as to the size of the state. It's uh, about 65 and a half square miles, 1,000 square miles, which makes it 23rd as far as area rank. It's elevation. The highest one would be 
Tim's Hill, which is 1,951 feet, which I'm very surprised that Wisconsin is as flat as it is. I would have thought at some point it would have had some mountains somewhere, but apparently it doesn't. Its lowest elevation is Lake Michigan at 579 feet. A lot of the state um, was created through the Ice Age, which flattened and caused a bunch of, like, uh, rivers, ponds, valleys, whatever you want to call it. But except for down here, like, this little region of uh, the U.S. really didn't see much in the way of Ice Age. Because I think the ice, ice sheets kind of kind of stopped before they got here. Um, let's see here. The population is almost 6 million, which makes it 20th as far as population. The median household income is $59,000, which makes it 23rd, which average. Very average. The word for the state, Wisconsin, is debated. Um, I guess one of the first written versions of it was from French trappers who got it from the, uh, where is it, where is it, where is it, where is it, um, God damn it, I just I got, uh, potentially Algonquin, Algonquin. Uh, the French wrote it as Wisconsin, O-U-I, S, so it's spelled like Wisconsin now, but instead of W-I, it's O-U-I, like we, French, County Road G, which means absolutely nothing to me, because I'm sure we're on 46. We're going to adopt a highway, so Route 46, I think it says, that's the road marker for Wisconsin. It looks like every other state picked one, and they had to come up with something, so it's just a very generalized, like, symbol. It's, it's a bit silly. Route 46, now we have to try to find it. Um, I just found 48, but again, uh, their numbering system. As we fall victim to so many times, could really mean anything. This is the Upper Peninsula. Why am I looking there? I don't know. I found 42. None of them. I found 47. I found 47 again. <clears throat> 46, that's north south, I believe. So hopefully I will come across it. Not seeing it though. Still not seeing it. We're just going along the border until it becomes apparent to me. Because this method always works. 45 again, 54, 54. Man, nothing. Still 64. These are numbers, but 48. East, west. 46, here we go. All right. 46 seems to... I think it might be an amalgamation of a couple of routes. So I'm just going to put us here and look for some uh, road signs here. We're north on 46. All right. Looking for towns. I have a feeling 46 is a super long... Oh, yeah, that's right. I have to look for County Road G. That will help me. Um, so there's H, there's GG. So County Road G should be right along here. I found CC. Hmm. There's G. I'm going to say we're on this. Yeah, it says US Highway 63. I think it's a combination of both. We'll see if I can't maybe get a town name to help me out here. But I, was, I, I learned something with you today that Wisconsin is far more flat than I thought it was going to be. Um, it's a huge uh, agricultural state. Um, as far as where are we? I just saw this. I should really note this stuff down here. Uh... Wisconsin produces about a quarter of America's cheeses. Oh, shit, I've got 10 seconds. Hopefully I nailed it. I mean, it's County Road G. Every county probably has their own alphabetical system, but I'm, 
I'm sticking. I'm sticking with it. I'm feeling confident, and God fucking damn it. <laughs> oh, it's another one. Oh well. At least got the root, I believe, down. Um, Wisconsin produces about a quarter of America's cheese, leading the nation in cheese production. Although my state, Vermont, has something I would like to say about that. It is second in milk production after California, third in per capita milk production behind California and Vermont. Wisconsin is second in butter, butter production, producing about one quarter of the nation's butter. You can go ahead and make all the butter you want. Wisconsin, I'm not stopping you. I think they also have like a butter sculpture festivals or competitions that happen in uh, Wisconsin where they actually just make sculptures out of butter. Like sandcastles, just replace the sand with butter, and there you go. Okay, they said no fo blurred photos or photospheres. They lied to me. Get me out of here. Thank you. I'm not doing that again. We're heading out of town, which bums me, because now I don't know if I'll actually uh, find out where we are. No, I wanted to be. I, I wanted to be on this road. Thank you. There's a church here. Ah, that doesn't help me. I was hoping it would have said a town. I guess we have to, we have to go this way. I'm hoping that eventually I will get good imagery. I don't know how much hope I have that we will, but I gotta go. Oh god, these photos are so terrible. Speed limit 15. Fuck you. Kind of an asshole has speed limit 15 be there. Oh, that's terrible. Water main flushing. Wasa River Works. Wow, Sal. So, I think we're here in Wausau. Uh, exactly where, I couldn't tell you, but maybe one of these. Forest and Tenth, you say. Uh, South Tenth. So let's look for Forest, because here's South Tenth. South Tenth. And Forest Street. Well, South Tenth ends. I do not see a Forest Street anywhere. So maybe it's not here. Um, let's try the next intersection. Let's see what this one says. North 10th, Jackson. All right, so North 10th, Spruce, Elm. And these are all trees. Norton, Natton. Okay, 10th ends. Man, where are you? Is there another 10th, like, up here? No, it doesn't look it. So it's got to be over here. I forget exactly the name of the town that, uh, um, it was separated by a river in, uh, I think it's Milwaukee. Yes, um, I believe what happened in Milwaukee is they were, you know, giving land away. And one side of the river uh, was founded before the other. And I think there was some sort of argument between people who lived in one city. And so they decided, fuck it, we're just going to go make our own town. And they got incredibly petty to the point where none of the streets would line up if, like, you were to... Um, See, like, a road here didn't match up. They were off-centered, so what they had to do when they finally merged cities or the towns together is they had to, like, angle their bridges. Instead of being straight across, they had to go kind of, like, sideways because two people were too busy fighting over fighting each other, being incredibly petty. But, uh, did I click? I did. I'm Hopefully I'm close enough. I believe it was... In Milwaukee. Oh, we were on the other side of the river. A lot of 10th streets here. But anyway, 
Back to the agriculture. State ranks first nationally in production of corn, cranberries, and ginseng, which I didn't know he made ginseng here. They also make snap beans, which are apparently green beans. They're just apparently about snap beans as well. Uh, 97% of the nation's ginseng is made in Wisconsin. I didn't know that there was a market for it. And Wisconsin, if you're thinking about getting a foothold in it, good luck to you, brother. All right, so we're on a highway next to Stanley. I'm not seeing a uh, highway marker. Does this one tell me on the mileage? It does not. It just says we're on 101. Let me, A&W food, let me see where we are. We're in Stanley. All right, so does Stanley pop up anywhere quickly? I do not see it. All right, so we'll go back, look for an exit, find the highway number there. You know, you know how we do it. So let's get off. Um, business district, I do not care. Give me the highway. Uh, signage over here. Route 29. Um, where are you? That's north, north, south is 29. All right. You're not showing up. Well then, that's how we're gonna play. I have to do this now. You happy? 29, correct? Yep. Looking, looking. See nothing. See 29 here, but is that a highway? I uh, I don't I don't know. Huh, I was I was expecting to see a uh Okay, Wausau. So Wausau is, zoom out, we were just there. Wausau is there. So yes, we're on 29 here, so Stanley. We're going to look here, Chippewa Falls. Um... I am confusing myself to no end. So if Wasau is that way, Chippewa Falls, are we, are we this way? There's Stanley, actually. Let me hit a home, because I want to double check exactly if this is Stanley. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it does, but I, I just need to check. Humor me, please. That exit sign wasn't that far away, was it? We got a minute left. All right. Stanley on road H and X. There's X. There's H. So, Wasau was this Chippewa Falls. Okay, so, this, we're like here, I believe. Can I see a jail? Um, that looks to be a jail, all right. Correctional facility, if you will. I think I nailed it. Maybe we're more like right... Uh, maybe like right there, I'll say. Let's see, what else? Uh, a large part of the state's manufacturing sector includes commercial food processing, including well-known brands such as Oscar Mayer, Tombstone Frozen Pizza, that's a bit of a stretch, Johnsonville Brats, eh, okay. And I've never heard of Usinger Sausage. Oh, give me more points than that, you bastard. Uh, let's see. Craft food alone employs more than 5,000 people in the state. Miliwake is a major producer of beer and was formerly headquarters of the Miller Brewing Company, the nation's second largest brewer until it mer merged with Coors. Formerly Schlitz, Blatz, and Pabst. Cornerstone breweries in Milwaukee, but they they all jump ship. 
Finally. And this this is almost the season it is right now, and I'm very much looking forward to it. It was nice and cool these past couple of mornings. The hike I did yesterday was so nice. I'm very much looking forward to that. Oh, the fun thing of driving on the highway, getting uh, on a road, getting stuck behind a uh, uh, tractor. Can I find out where we are by looking at this? Lake Holcomb Marina, huh? Well, I don't know how many lakes there are. Is this Lake Holcomb? No, it's Lake Winnebago. Green Lake. Lake Holcomb? No, you're Rush Lake. I wonder if they play uh, 2110 on loop there. I'm just seeing if I get lucky by doing this, but I, I doubt I'm going to find Lake Holcomb this way, so I should probably continue... Looking for root signs. Uh, is that Holcomb? That might say like Holcomb Cemetery. Yeah. So I think we're in the town of uh, Holcomb. Chris Caps Capsner. Uh, much like other states in the northern Midwest, there's also a large con uh, contingency of... German, uh, Scandinavian ancestry. And a lot of the festivals they still have can very much be tied back to that. Um, can I? Okay, we're on junction of county. That does not help me in any way. Give me... We're north on 27. Okay, I finally have something to go with. Problem is, this is a big enough state where I don't know if I'm going to find 27 in time. But we're going to try. God damn it. Looking, looking, looking. There's 29. I think we're like super in there, and I don't know if this is going to be worth it doing this. Oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Uh, well that did say 27, I believe, right? South on 27. All right. Let's just look at it, because I have no other um, means to maybe find this place. 23, 27. All right. I found 27. Now it's just trying to find Holcomb. 27's here. 27 seems to have disappeared and ended. All right, so let's just say it's here. I know it's probably not, but I don't know what else to do. I'll say we're here. Let's see how horribly off I am. I have a feeling I'm very much so. Let's hit home. Let's head the other way real quick. See if maybe one of these things will uh Lake Holcomb. Alright, so we gotta look for a lake. Mississippi River. I'm not seeing any lakes upon twenty seven here. Hmm. Well, we were as far away as possible. There's Lake Holcomb. I just didn't follow the road far enough north to get to it. Not a good showing. I nailed one. Came close. Well, nailed kind of two. Then the three others were just... Ugh. But that's the wonderful state of Wisconsin. Home of cheese. Green Bay Packers. And butter. And apparently a lot of ginseng. Very flat state. Thank you all for watching. If you had any comments, questions, concerns, complaints, suggestions, likes, favorite, comments, subscribe, click all those things, type all those things, put them down below. I will read them and get back to you. This week continues. Stay tuned for tomorrow for the baking. Um, I'm like 2080 right now, whether or not I'm going to do any more magic stuff, just because it doesn't seem like 
not many people care. Maybe I've kind of burnt out on it, but if there's interest, I'll keep doing it. Just let me know. Thank you all for watching, and I will see you real soon. So go have a good one, and I'll be here waiting with another video real soon.